For years, far-sighted people in Kingston have been thinking of a new building for their boys' club, and now at last the dream is reality, thanks to the efforts of show business in the shape of the Variety Club of Great Britain and young Kingston businessmen through Kingston upon Thames round table number 19. The new club is here and being officially opened. Mr. Billy Butlin, this year's chief barker of the Variety Club, greets the guests as they arrive. They include both local figures and leading show business personalities, among them several past chief barkers of the Variety Club, such as Mr. Mike Frankovich, arriving now with Mrs. Frankovich. And here comes the Mayor of Kingston, Councillor M.J. Geimer, with the Mayoress, welcomed by the Bishop of Kingston and Mr. Butlin. Two hundred guests gather in the marquee to listen to the speeches. That's a fine moustache at this end. Well, what do you know? It's Mr. Pastry. Mr. C.J. Latter and Mr. D.J. Goodlatt, both past chief barkers and local residents, played a big part in the planning which finally brought this project to fruition. And there's another past chief barker, Colonel James Carreras. The Variety Club donated £5,250 towards the cost of this new headquarters and Kingston Roundtable, 2,400. The mayor cuts the tape, which seems to be pretty tough material, and formally declares the building open. Although this headquarters is new, Kingston Boys Club itself is a quarter of a century old. Up to now, it has met at St. Peter's School. It has become very near to the hearts of the people of Kingston, who have helped it a lot, individually and through their organisations, from the taxi men of Kingston to the East Surrey Regiment, from the borough magistrates to the football club. Now the Variety Club, with its splendid record of helping young people through many different channels, have added their support to Kingston's efforts, with results that hundreds of youngsters will enjoy for many years to come. Many contributions, local and national, adding up to a club that Kingston can be proud of. <laughs>